there, Deidre here from Our Outcycled Life. Have you ever used brats to create sparkly Christmas ornaments? They turn out absolutely beautiful. I bought a bunch of ornaments that were kind of drab from the thrift store. We're going to do this borax hack and you're gonna be blown away by how beautiful these are. So we have lots of work. Let's get started. To do this DIY, you're gonna need some borax. I grabbed mine off of Amazon. I'll put the link down below in the description. You'll need some wooden skewers, a big measuring cup, and a small measuring cup. I picked up all of this at the thrift store, some poinsettias, some star ornaments, and some icicles. And these are all going to have a glittery, gorgeous feel when they're all finished. I've boiled my kettle full of hot water. The measurements for this recipe are one third of borax to two cups of water. So I'm doing six cups of boiling water. So I'm gonna add three of these one third scoops of borax. You can mix the amount for how many ornaments you want to do, but when you're doing it, you wanna make sure you're mixing enough that you could submerge your ornaments that you want to sparkle. Once you've poured your borax into the hot water, stir it really well. Make sure it's all mixed and melted into that water. The first one I'm going to do in this pickle jar, I'm filling it right up to the top. I'm taking a wooden skewer and I'm just going to hang those icicle ornaments right from that wooden skewer. And then we're going to put them into the pickle jar, making sure they're completely submerged in the solution. One thing I ran into in the past is you have to make sure that your ornaments have enough weight to soak into the solution. I've picked some ornaments up before and they were too lightweight and they floated on the top and it didn't work. So these icicles are going to work perfect. We're gonna submerge them, set them aside. We're gonna let them sit till tomorrow. For these poinsettias, I'm just going to soak them, let them soak down into the bottom of this measuring cup and also we're gonna set them aside until tomorrow. Now you'll start to see the crystals or the glitter start to appear in a few hours, but I like to leave mine overnight so I can get all kinds of glitter on them. Now these stars are what I was talking about, about they don't soak down. So I'm going to lay them on the top and then after about six hours, I'm gonna flip them over and do the other side so I can get glitter on both sides of those ornaments. Now grab some coffee filters and we're going to turn these into snowflakes. I'm just folding it into itself about three or four times and then I'm gonna take my scissors, go back to school and remember how you used to make snowflakes and just cut out some patterns out of this coffee filter. Now borax is a cleaning product and I actually have no idea the chemistry behind this and why it crystallizes after time on these projects. I just think they're absolutely beautiful and I wanted to share this technique with you. Now, once you've gotten all of your shapes cut out of your coffee filter, you can open it up and you can see you have created a beautiful snowflake. So I'm gonna do two of these and then we'll do the borax hack to make them nice and glittery and crystallize them. We're now ready to work on these snowflakes. I've got two cups of boiling hot water. We're going to add one third of a cup of borax and we're gonna incorporate it together really, really well, making sure that it's all dissolved. I've got a baking sheet. I'm pouring that mixture over top of those coffee filters, making sure they're completely covered. And you can see I have a little bit of borax in the bottom that I didn't get incorporated, but I think I've got enough in the solution that it's gonna work perfect. Now we're gonna set this aside until tomorrow and I'll show you the results. So here are our icicle ornaments and you can see all the crystallizing on them. They're beautiful, they're glittery, and I think they look so much better than just those plastic icicles. I'm gonna put them on a piece of paper towel and spread them out and let them dry completely. And our little stars are done. Now these are really hard to see on camera, but there are sparkly little glitter all over these. I flipped them halfway through and they're just beautiful. But these poinsettias are 
gorgeous. Look at the crystallizing, the little sparkle, the glitter on them. They're beautiful. What a great way to perk up some really dull florals. Now look at our coffee filter snowflakes. These are just beautiful. I actually like making these and using them as doilies, but you can put a string through them and hang them up and they would be gorgeous too. And you could do all kinds of different sizes. And these all I have just let sit overnight for 24 hours. Here's our beautiful coffee filter snowflakes. And I've put this one as a doily on my little table and I think it's just absolutely beautiful. My star ornaments look gorgeous on my tree. That sparkle now from the borax. But I am blown away by how well these floral poinsettias turned out. They just took them to the next level. We can add these into a floral arrangement. We can tuck them into our tree. Absolutely gorgeous. Now, after you've done this borax Christmas ornament hack on your ornaments, it's a good idea to seal them up with some polyacrylic sealer because they are very fragile and the crystals will drop off, especially on these ornaments like this. So if you have some polyacrylic sealer, give it two or three coats to seal it all in and they will last forever. I hope you've enjoyed today's Christmas DIY using borax to create glittery ornaments. Thanks for watching, have a great day, and we'll see you in the next video. And if you love this video, I'm sure you'll love either of these next two. Take care.